For the yoga warm-up and stretching, we'll start in the corpse pose. That is laying flat on your back with your arms at your side, eyes closed, and just focusing on the breath. For the full body stretch, we bring our arms all the way up above our head and stretch from our fingertips down to our feet. The lying twist requires us to bring our knees into our chest, arms out to the side lying flat, and then bring both knees over to the right. Hold it as close to the ground as you can with your shoulders flat on the ground as well. Then come back up to the center and then over to the left. Make sure your shoulders are flat on the ground and you're still facing the ceiling. Then we're going to bring both knees in, give them a big hug. Move on to our happy baby pose. So bring both of your arms inside of your knees and then grab the outsides of your feet. And then you're going to slowly rock from side to side on your lower back. We'll move on to the half Lord of the Fishes pose or the pretzel pose. Take your right foot, cross it over your left knee, and then we're going to take our left foot and just tuck it under. Then opposite elbow to your knee for a side stretch. And then we're going to switch it up. Take your left foot, put it over your right knee, take your right foot and tuck it behind. And then you're going to take your opposite elbow and twist stretch. Last in our warm up is the easy pose. Just sit nice and tall, one leg in front of the other. We're going to stretch the neck starting on the right side. Take your head over to the right and guide it with your right hand gently. Then come back up to the center and then down to the left using your left hand to guide. And then back up to the center, take it all the way back, look straight up to the ceiling, and then bring it all the way forward, chin to your chest. Standing up, we are going to do a standing forward bend. Your knees are slightly bent and you are reaching down toward your feet. Hold that pose and then slowly come up to a standing tall position. The mountain pose is a balance pose where you are focusing on the ground below you and your balance. Palms are facing out, your arms are by your side, you're standing nice and tall. From there, we're going to move into a swan dive. Bring your arms all the way up, in, inhaling all the way up to your hands or above your head, and then you're gonna swan dive them. So they're gonna come back behind you a little bit, all the way down during the exhale until you are back down with your feet near, hands near your feet. Tree pose requires us to start in the mountain pose. And then when we are balanced, we will start with bringing your right foot up first. You can bring your foot either to your calf or to your thigh, just not anywhere on your knee. Keeping it there and a nice tall back, you are going to focus on something to keep your balance. Try to hold it there, bringing your hands to heart center. Tadasana is standing grounded, like in the mountain pose. We are moving our arms and our hands all the way up above our head until we can get our palms together as high up above our head as we can. And then from there, we are going to move into a standing back bend. So just stretch all the way back, arching your back and looking up. All right, we're going to finish off today's lesson with some static stretches, starting with butterfly stretch, heels together. And right leg out, left foot in, extend both arms to your right foot. Then we're gonna go opposite, left foot, try not to pull back on your toes, just extend your hands as far as you physically can go. You wanna hold these stretches for about 20 to 30 seconds. Feet together, extend out to your ankles or as far as you can go. If you can go beyond your sneaker, perfect. All 
open up and we're going to extend hands flat on the ground. You're going to bring your right foot over your left. Both arms outside the right leg, back stretch. And switch. Right arm across your chest, hold tight at the elbow. Switch. Right elbow above, hold tight at the elbow. Switch. In closing, if you choose to try today's lesson at home, please make sure that you have enough space to do so for safety. Only attempt the skills described in this video if a parent or guardian is present in the case